here is a case of a stone in the kidney which is very difficult for the PCNL to be honest. RIRS also it was difficult in this case. He is actually going for the pre-employment checkup. Just 5.9 mm is the size measured in the CT. But he wanted to get it removed. See, if this is the CT. This is the posterior wall. And it looks very small. Diverticular large stone is okay. But very small diverticular stone is uh, difficult. URSL is done. After you are, luckily ureter was uh, dilated, non-stented. Here 100% result we have to give. If his uh, employment checkup shows any stone, it is difficult. Now it is posterior so we have to look down. Identifying the opening is very difficult when the stone is very small. So the suspected area we went and searched and then close search in all the area uh, taken. See here, very. this is the case where digital, digital, first time I felt that when you have good vision, it's like searching a small transition cell carcinoma in the bladder. So once uh, that is released, uh, all these stones we have to remove. So when you use a uh, encircle basket, you cannot remove. This is where first time I felt that N compass basket where distally small holes will be there will trap 2-3 stones so that number of times you go in and out uh, will be uh, less. Can you imagine uh, sub mucosal it is there, it might have been very difficult for PCNL. So RIRS with a good digital scope, if you search in the region of the CT where the stone is there, then if you incise the mucosa and immediately submucosal the stones have come. This may not be possible always. See this is the coagulum, uh, coagulum making all these stones together and that makes uh, a removal of the stones uh, better. They may pass out by themselves but for this patient we were chasing, chasing, chasing nearly 12 times the flexible scope uh, has gone in and out. Uh, to give complete clearance on the table. Otherwise what happens when they go to the job they will do high quality CT scan and if these stones see approximately there are 25 stones uh, which were looking only 5.9 mm on the CT. So these are very very good cases for RIRS whereas very difficult for PCN. Thank you.